Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to play The Killer Soul Will Shine by Collective Soul. Alright, let's just get started. 10 and 12 on the D, then 10 and 10 on the G and B string. Those are called double stops. 12 on the D, and then back to the 10, 10 on the G and B. Do that twice. Do it a third time and stop on the 12. So it sounds like this. A little faster. Then what he does, he does a double stop on the 12th fret of the G and B, to the 10th fret of the G and B, to the 12th fret on the D. You do that four times. Then you play double stop on the 10th fret of the G and B, to the 12 on the D, and open A. All together. If you value this content, I'll leave a video up there you can watch next. He's doing 10, 13 on the low E, 10 on the A, 13 on the low E. Then this pattern is two hammer runs on the a string, 10 on the D, 12 on the A, go down to the next string, do the same thing on the D string, and then play 10 on the G, 12 on the D, and run on the G string, 10 to 12, and then go down to the 10th fret of the B, to the 12th fret on the G, then hammer on twice to the 10 and 13 on the B string. Then play the 10 on the high E. And then just pull off from the 13 to the 10 on the B. All together slow. Tap on the 50. Pull off to the 13, to the 10. Hammer on to the 13, tap, do it one more time. Tap the third time, then slide to the 22nd fret. After he does that, pull off from the 13 to the 10, and then uh, hold that bend on the 13th fret of the high E. And then 10, 13, 10. Then play the 13th again on the B string. There's 15 on the B, 13 on the high E, 15 on the B, and 13 on the B. And bend on the 15th on the high E. Then 13, 15 on the B. And then 13 on the high E, 15 on the B, 13 on the B, 15 on the B. And then that half step bend on the 15th on the high E. Again, 13, 15 on the B, and 15, 13, 15, 15 all on the B string. And then that half step bend on the 15th fret of the high E, and 13, 15 again on the B. Then 15, 13, two times on the B. Together. And we do 16, 13 pull off and 15, 13 pull off on the high E. Then 15 on the B, 13 on the high E. And then go to the B string, pull off from the 15th to the 13th. Then he pulls off from the 14th to the 13th on the B, to the 14th on the G, to the 13th on the B. Then go to the G string, pull off from the 14th to the 13th, then 14th to the 12th. 
hammer on pull off from the 10 to the 12 on the G and then 12 on the D 10 on the G so those together slow Then it pulls off from the 12th to the 10 on the D. Then a slow bend on the 12th fret of the G. And while you bend up, hit that 13th on the B. Then a quick bend with that 13 and 12 to the 10 on the G. Slow bend. Then hit the 12 on the D, and then double stop on the 10 on the G and B. Do that twice. Then 10, 12. And then with that 12 and 13, bend up quick again to the 10 on the G. Then two times on the D. Double stop on the 10th fret of the G and B. And then 12, 10. That's the whole solo. like this content, I'll leave a video up here you can watch also.